The solution we're going to see now allows you to have a message appear only the first time you open the application. I'm going to leave the link to download this Unity package on the end screen. But before that, let's see how it works. Inside the package, you'll find this script that basically does all the job. The only thing you have to do is to assign this script to a game object different from the object that you want to show or hide. In this particular case, we want to make this canvas object that contains all the elements of the pop-up message appear only the first time the application is started. What we have to do is, for example, create an empty object, add the script to it, assign the game object of the pop-up message in the inspector field, define a unique name to save the information, and with this we would be ready. Press play and we see that the message appears, exit the game mode and the pop-up window won't show up again. Some important details. Make sure that all the objects related to the pop-up window are children of the object that you assign in Inspector. And this button, the only thing it does is to deactivate the game object of the pop-up window when pressed. In the onclick function of the button, click on the plus sign, drag the game object you want to deactivate. In this panel, go to game object, choose the set active function and make sure that this checkbox is unchecked. This way, when you press the button, the game object will be deactivated. In Inspector, there is an option to delete the information and simulate that it's the first time the application is started. Just check this box, a message will appear in the console, and the next time you enter in game mode, the object will appear. The script looks a little bit complicated, but actually only these three instructions matter. First of all, load the saved data using the name. If there is no saved data, the default value is zero. Activate the game object if the value is zero, and deactivate if not. And finally, overwrite the data with a 1 so that the next time this code is executed, the message doesn't appear again. Here you can download the Unity package. I hope you find it useful. Please subscribe to my channel and I will see you in the next video.